Hi, I'm Mark with ClinicSense, and in this video, we're going to talk about how to customize your forms. To start, click on Setup, and then select Form Builder. Now, I've selected the Health History form, and under the options for the Health History form, you'll, you'll see a number of different selections or choices that you can make. How often does this form need to be updated? We recommend every year, but you have a number of options from Do Not Send Automatically to Just Before the First Appointment to Before Every Appointment to before every appointment, but on the last reminder and every six, 12, or 24 months. Also, you can select what services require this form. So you might have services that don't require a health history form, and you can uncheck those so that that doesn't get sent out at that time. Lastly, you can customize where this form appears in order with the other forms. So you can select it, which one it comes after, and um, your clients will get it in the logical order that you've decided on. You also have the ability to add your own questions. So if you scroll to the very bottom of the page, there's the big blue plus, you'll select that. And here you have a number of options. First, a short answer question, a long answer question, multiple choice, and a whole bunch more. So you'll be able to select exactly what is gonna serve your needs for the kind of question that you wanna add. You'll type your question here, and you'll be able to insert the type of box that you want. For a short answer, for example, it'll be a small one. For a long answer, it'd be a paragraph. You also have the ability to make it a required question. You can make it for office use only if it's just something that you want to use internally. And then when you're done, you'll hit save. Now, the last bit I wanted to talk about was display logic. Display logic allows you to make a qu ask a question after you get an answer to another question. So for example, in this situation, um, we're going to select have you had any experience or previous experience with massage therapy? And if the answer is yes, then they're going to get the question that we've decided on here, which is a short answer. And you could say, uh, for example, when was your last massage? But that question will only come up if your client has had previous experience with massage therapy. So that's how you customize a form. If you have any questions about this or anything else, don't hesitate to reach out. As always, we can be found at support at clinicsense.com. Have a great day.